Hello, my name is Aline Villa, and I am a lifelong resident of this beautiful beach town of Oceano. And first of all, I'd like to say that I am a director on the Oceano Community Service District and that I am in no way in any capacity speaking for the Oceano Community District. I'm just speaking as a longtime concerned resident of Oceano. When you drive into Oceano, you will see our welcoming sign and it says, Welcome Oceano to Oceano, the gateway of the dunes. And through the decades, we've become so popular with the dune community that unfortunately we have now heavy traffic here every weekend coming in and out and we're more like the highway to the dunes and the gateway to the dunes. As a consequence, it's a, a very unsafe beach and not pedestrian friendly at all. Here if you come you have children, you constantly have to keep an eye so that they don't get run over and also it's just not very pleasant to see a bunch of cars in front of the waves. In 2017 there was a study done which stated that uh, there was like $243 million that were brought into uh, the county of San Luis Obispo from people visiting the Pismo Oceano Dunes area. And this of course upset many in our community because being an underserved community, um, we uh, don't get many of these monies coming into our community because we don't have the restaurants, stores, the shopping areas for the tourists that come here to visit our beautiful beaches. So uh, it would be nice that would if, if we could get at least 50 cents per visitor so that we could have safe access because we don't even have safe access to the beach. We need desperately need crosswalks uh, to our beach and also it would be nice to have a bike path and just more amenity, nicer amenities here on our beach. Unfortunately, that is not the case. So I'm hoping the environmental justice team will um, help us and support us and do something so that we can get justice for Oceano. Thank you.